So Discord, you know, we were going to be reporting live from uh, Sweet Apple Acres, but I heard there was some chocolate rain. <laughs> <laughs> there was. But everything's all resolved. Everything's cool. Ponyville's back to normal. And uh, it feels like Discord's shit really only affected Ponyville. No, it definitely affected all of Equestria. No, no, you no, just no, weren't no. looking. No, no, because when Twilight Sparkle cast the spell at the end to fix it all, which I wonder if that's the spell she tried to cast in the beginning when she's like, I know how to fix this. Mm-hmm. And then it didn't do anything. This big bubble just like appears like all over all of like Ponyville. And then it goes away and everything's normal. That's because that was where. Uh, is the rest of Equestria still all fucked? Well, it wasn't right. So he, he basically, you know, Discord says he's going to make Ponyville like the, the chaos capital of the world. Right. Uh, so maybe he hasn't like moved out into the right. Rest it's yet. like you don't have to go. You know, you can just take out Mordor. You don't need to take out the whole thing. You know, it's enough to take down the tower. But was other stuff happening? Like, yeah. In, are you sure? Yeah, we we didn't see it. it doesn't, just because you didn't see it doesn't mean it wasn't happening. Yeah, I don't, He just, did a lot of fucked up shit in, uh, you know, uh, Canterlot. And there was definitely chocolate rain everywhere. Was it? Yeah, yeah it's hard to say, though. <laughs> what do you mean it's hard to say? I mean, because the, it bothers me that Twilight Sparkle's reset everything spell, which was separate from the turn him to stone magic. Well, the reset everything spell wasn't actually her spell. It was just the elements of harmony doing their thing. Are you sure? Yeah, that's where because the, the same giant rainbow that killed him is the giant rainbow that split in half and did the cleanup. So how did the elements of harmony know to do that, and why didn't they do a similar thing when they took out uh, Nightmare Moon? How did the freaking four stars know to revive? It's the same shit. I still wonder who those four stars are. Maybe you'll they find gotta come out. Back. <laughs> four stars. Yep. But it, the other reason I bring that up is that it was very clearly, cheerily said in the school, a Draconiquist. This creature is called a Draconiquist. He is the head of a pony and a body made up of all sorts of things. As though that there are more of them. They are I'm just sure there a are. race. So he's yeah. just one. Where are they? Know, are they out there somewhere? Maybe. You know, I mean, it, it's it's not like just because a particular monster exists doesn't mean there's a lot of them, right? We saw a manticore. I'm sure there are other manticores, but it's not like manticores travel in a herd. But it's not time, like they have manticore town, but, right? There's a manticore here, and there's a manticore in there, and there's there's a few in some dungeons. There's maybe a hundred in the whole world, something like that. But Discord was very powerful, so I feel like if there were any other of his race about, they would have been causing trouble. Maybe they're not. That's just because they're very powerful doesn't mean they're necessarily evil. Maybe and such. So you're saying that maybe Discord himself is just a dick, and for all we know, the rest of his race is totally well, chill. Well, he just loved chaos. If you're, you know, his name was Discord. There might be another Draconicus. His name could be Joe, <laughs> and he likes to use his Draconicus magic yep. to make pony donuts. At least I no longer can say anything about the fact. You know, we know the the, the Pony Sisters conquered his realm and turned him to stone. I feel like that might have been justified. Well, seeing what he turned that realm into. If that was even close to what it was like back in the day. I don't know, but I mean, like, you know, it's the only problem with, with having a crazy chaos realm is that the people who live there are upset, and it's like, you know... If what, move somewhere else, go to Cloudsdale, or everything's awesome? Exactly. <laughs> you know, I mean, maybe someone likes to live there. Pinkie Pie. Yeah. I love how in the very end, they're going to take him out, and she's like, hold on. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> wouldn't you do the same thing? <laughs> I don't know. why. I, I would have had like buckets outside to collect the chocolate. Uh, what if it was at, like... And is a question, did the chocolate like disappear? What, you know, like if you ate the chocolate and then, you know, the, the elements of harmony fixed it, would the chocolate disappear from inside your stomach? Huh. Yeah, I wonder what it undid. Right. Like what was the scope of its undoing? We didn't see any you of the You still aftermath. have the memory of the tasting of the chocolate. We basically just cut, maybe you lose also, that Also, what kind of chocolate was it? Was it dark chocolate? Was it tr- shitty ass milk chocolate? I don't think it would have, uh, it might have been good chocolate. It could have been really, it, it could have been really great chocolate, like the best. No, if it was the best, Pinkie Pie would not have let them and finish how, Discord And off. how good was the cotton candy cloud, you know? Well, the animals liked it. Sure, but I mean, was it awesome or was it just like a cotton candy? Pinkie Pie is the only one who seems to know. Yeah, but she'll eat friggin' like Hershey. She doesn't give a shit. <laughs> well, she <laughs> ate those, uh, well, the big bads took her down. That's true, but, but they would did, take anyone down. But she did eat Apple Bloom's cupcakes. Yeah. If you can call them that. Right. So. <laughs> you, she- but look at what's going on here. So originally I complained that, all right, well, I didn't complain, but the, the Pony Sisters conquered this land from Discord where he made, you know, the unicorn, the Pegasus, the Earth Ponies unhappy. Right. But. It's almost like he is this primordial force of chaos. Look at a lot of other myths. It's always, there's chaos, and then some god or someone comes in and puts order, and that's when the real stuff starts. 
So I feel like maybe Celestia and Luna are that. They're the Marduk. They're the forces of order that come in and mess up. Not Mordak. <laughs> <laughs> you know you were thinking it. 